There you are, ladies and gentlemen. Good sports. Enjoy yourself. Responsibility. Is that how you say that? Responsibly, yes. All right. In Vancouver. Well, tell us about the jacket. What's well, wait on? a minute. I, I will tell you about the jacket. Oh. I want them to look at it. In Vancouver, in Winnipeg, in Calgary, people have signed up in over 100 uh, stadiums down the states. And they've signed up all over. And they put their, this is the signature they did. They embroidered John the Coop, put it on. And it's from Budweiser. And it's a, a great uh, program and you're ticked off because they only give you 12 beers, right? <laughs> they, said, they did send beer to our house and I'm not I complaining but 12's an hour. Okay, let's look at this fan at the well, Blue Jays game. Please. Wait a minute. Just a minute. Go. Everybody loves a bud and here's a guy that sacrificed getting the ball at the Blue Jay game. By the way, they won. Look at that guy. He says, I still got my bud. Blue Jays won again today, by the way. Look at that. And he looks around and he says to his buddy, I got it. But he turns around and says, look at the lady, he says, I still got my bud. All right, we paid our salary. All you right, let's it. go. Drink responsibly. Here's what you said after 20 minutes Wednesday night in Tampa. Listen. I'll tell you one thing, boys. I don't like it when I'm leading one nothing and I outplay them that way. He, uh, Joel's going to get him in there, and he's going to give it to him. They'll be a different team. You, they should have got that second goal. So, tonight? Uh, you know, charm and good looks alone. you got to know what you're talking about there. And he did. He got him going. I don't think they're going to win this game and uh, because they're, they're desperate. Tampa, that's the way it works for it. That's the way I can do it. All right, let's go. Well, let's look at the Peckett goal, Don. Now, watch this here. Watch this goal. Watch Kane going out to block the shot. Now, I like Kane, but he's got to do better in this. Look. Oh, don't hit me. Now, watch Sade goes out and gets the guy. Gives him the house. She going for the goal. Look at this. What, are you kidding me? This is your beer league. They wouldn't do that. You got to do better when the guy's got the point of it like that. Hey, uh, you had a great chat with Scotty Bowman, Don. Just before we get to Al Arbor, uh, your buddy seems to be Brent Seabrook, and you caught this in the free game. No, scheme. wait a minute. Hold it. Like, you know, first of all, it, well, you, it was funny. You said, darling. I said, look at that there. This is a guy. I know I'm always talking about it. Here's darling. He's never going to get in the game. But watch. He includes everybody. Hitting everybody. Come on, you'll get in there if you do your okay. job. That's what you kids, when you're a leader, that's what you have to do. You have to take care of the guy that's not playing. Because Darling knows he's never getting in unless he gets hurt. So, yeah. Alan. Now, well, this is the jacket here. They all put all the embroideries. Now, you know, uh, my buddy Al Arbor is having a tough time right now. And, and, and um, Glenn Healy told me, and he, yeah, I got all the information from Glenn that Kelly, they, lo they love the guy that he has played and coached more playoff games than anybody in the history of the game. More than Scotty, more than Joel. And he, this guy, is, we can put it up some, this guy was unbelievable coach. Here he is when he played for St. Louis. He blocking shots. This was his forte, as they say, blocking shots. He is really, he is really something. And when he coached in the National Hockey League, Kelly and them, you should talk to him a bit. There he is there. Four Stanley Cups. And when he, uh, when he coached, there he is. And four when he and uh, four when he was uh, playing for Toronto and Chicago and Detroit. Mm -hmm. I know he looks kind of tough there right now and everything, but boy, he, he was. Uh, I coached against him. He was tough to coach against. He even caught me in a mistake one time and made me embarrassed. But now here he is there. Doesn't he look great there? We're going to end with that. But I knew him when he was in the in the minors. I knew him when he when he played was my defense partner and with Daryl Sly and that. And here he is when when he started out. He wears glasses. He was the last guy to wear glasses. I have to laugh when Daryl when he was uh, coming. And there it is at a Christmas party. There's Claire, number 13. There's uh, uh, there's Al. There's Joanne is 11 and 14 is Jay. That's Cindy, my daughter. And there's Rose and there's Timothy and that's me and Larry Hillman. He's to the right there. And I, and he was the guy. And there he is. He was captain when he won the uh, uh, won the Calder Cup. There he was our captain. That's Jack Riley. It's me, those achievers, <laughs> achievers, how young achiever is. And there he is again uh, in the middle. What a great guy he was. You know, you know, Ron, guys win the Stanley Cup, and there he is again. Guys win the Stanley Cup. It's really something. And he wins four Stanley Cups and the whole deal. And, he, and there's my favorite one. There's Al on the right, Dwayne Rupp, and that's me with the bottle. And Daryl Sly, my partner, when we won our last uh, Calder Cup there. And, you know, when guys win and everything like that, so everybody's a good guy in the National Hockey League, but they all change a little. I swear to God, you, I, I went to the my, he went on to glory, and I met him four years after he won all the cups. He was the same guy 
as he was when he won all cup. He was a great guy. And uh, Kelly, you ask Kelly. Kelly should do a thing on him too. And Glenn, they'll tell you they all loved him. And uh, Sudbury, huh? So you stay true to Sudbury. Here's uh, Jarmelson, just because you wanted to get this. I want to tip for the kids. Oh, I know. I got to be quick here, kids. Listen to me when I tell you about blocking shots. It's the most dangerous thing in the world. Watch how he turns his head. We're going to show it again. I know you think of their heroes and everything like that, but always turn your head. And if remember, protect yourself at all times. I love the game and I love the team, but always protect yourself first. That's the main thing in life. Good stuff. It's his birthday, by the way, so that's nice that he got on. Uh, it's D-Day, of course, and it's a day to send a prayer and a thought to Al Arbor. On the Coach's Corner on Hockey Night in Canada, on Rogers.